The Puerto Rico national baseball team Spanish, Selección de Béisbol de Puerto Rico is the national baseball team of Puerto Rico. The men's senior team is currently ranked 10th in the world, while its women's counterpart is 8th. After debuting in the amateur predecessor to the Baseball World Cup, the team won its first medal by finishing second in 1947, a performance that it repeated the following year. In 1951, Puerto Rico became the world baseball champion by winning the event. The team went on to gather six more medals during the tournament's existence, finishing second twice and third four times. Puerto Rico was an inaugural member of the World Baseball Classic, making its debut in the first edition. The team has advanced to the second round in all of its appearances, in the process becoming the first team to score mercy rule wins over Cuba and the United States. In the 2013 World Baseball Classic, Puerto Rico became the second team from Western Hemisphere to advance to the final, eliminating two-time defending world champion Japan in the semi-finals before finishing as the event's runner-up. The team has also participated in several lesser international competitions, such as the Central American and Caribbean Games, the Pan American Games, America's Baseball Cup, Intercontinental Cup and Harlem Baseball Week, winning medals in most. Topic. Current roster Topic. Baseball World Cup era Topic. Early years of amateur baseball Puerto Rico made its debut at the Baseball World Cup, then known as the Amateur World Series. In 1940, only two years after the creation of the Liga de Béisbol Profesional Roberto Clemente (LBPPR), which at the moment was an amateur league, like all of the other expansion teams, they finished in the bottom half of the table, tied with Mexico with a record of 2 to 10. The following year, the team repeated this performance, finishing tied with El Salvador. Between 1942 and 1943, Puerto Rico did not participate due to the ongoing World War II to which several LBPPR players were drafted. The team returned in 1944, but finished tied with Nicaragua with a record of 1-6. Puerto Rico declined participation in the 1945 Amateur World Series, joining Mexico and Cuba in absence. World Championship As the LBPPR expanded and became more organized, the quality of players composing the Puerto Rican national team improved. Returning in 1947, Puerto Rico won the silver medal, having entered the round robin tied with a record of 6-2, defeating Nicaragua to advance before losing to the host, Colombia, in the finals. Puerto Rico went 6-1 in the round robin but lost 11-1 and 2-1 to the Dominicans in the best of three finals. They won their second straight silver medal. M. Ruiz tied for the most doubles four and most triples two. In 1950, the team finished the regular phase of the tournament tied with the Dominican Republic and Cuba for the first place with a record of 9-2. The team defeated Cuba and lost to the Dominican Republic during the round robin phase. However, the Federación Internacional de Béisbol Aficionado FIBA ruled that several players that had joined the team were ineligible to play, ruling several key victories, forfeits, and dropping it out of the podium. This incident was the result of the LBPPR from amateur to professional a few years earlier. In 1951, Puerto Rico earned a record of 7-3 in the regular stage, handing Cuba its only defeat in the first games. After advancing, the team went undefeated with wins over Cuba and Venezuela to secure the gold medal. The team was headlined by Sotero Ortiz who scored more runs 21 and stole more bases 10 than anyone else, while teammate Ramon Maldonado hit eight doubles to lead the statistic. In 1952, Puerto Rico went 7-3, including 2-2 in the final round to take bronze medal. They were the only team to beat Cuba in the finals. W. Figueredo led in triples three, while J.R. Garcia led in homers two, and steals seven. Sotero Ortiz tied for the most doubles four, and runs 13. Due to the improving quality of its players, Puerto Rico soon began experiencing the loss of its best players to the professional leagues at a very young age, including Roberto Clemente and Orlando Cepeda. 
In 1953, the team finished sixth with a record of 5–5. However, Felix Torres drove in 15 runs to lead the series. By the time that the series resumed in 1963, Major League Baseball had become the primary employer of Puerto Rican talent, making them ineligible to play in the Amateur World Series and the team did not participate in this edition. Back for the tournament in 1965, Puerto Rico won bronze with a 5-3 record. Andres Cruz led the series in average .485, hits 16, and RBI 8. Pitcher Efrain Contreras set an amateur World Series record by striking out 19 against the Netherlands Antilles. After another hiatus of four years, the event resumed in 1969, which saw Panama, Puerto Rico, Colombia and Nicaragua all tied for fifth with four to six records. Luis Mercado led the tournament in doubles six and tied for the most triples three. In 1970, Puerto Rico won the bronze medal with a record of 9-2. Ramon Ortiz hit the most home runs three in the competition. FIBA vs FEMBA, unique dual medalist In 1971, Puerto Rico finished tied with Nicaragua in the third place with a record of 6–3, but did not receive the bronze medal due to their individual series. Carlos Lowell led all pitchers with three wins. In 1972, Dominican Republic, Puerto Rico and Chinese Taipei tied for sixth, all with 9-6 marks. The team was managed by Roberto Clemente only weeks prior to his death and featured a no-hitter by Sandalio Quinones against Costa Rica. In 1973, Puerto Rico participated in two versions of the Amateur World Series due to internal conflicts in the sport. In the Federación Internacional de Béisbol Aficionado version, the team won the silver medal with a record of 10-3, with two of those loses coming at the hands of eventual winner, Cuba. J. Fontanes led in average .432. The team was managed by Vic Power. A splinter cell of the national team won the bronze at the event's Federación Mundial de Béisbol amateur version with a record of 8-2. Puerto Rico is the only participant to win medals in both of the 1973 events. Eventually the FIBA and FEMBA merged and the event had only one sanctioning body, the International Amateur Baseball Association IABF. In 1974, Puerto Rico finished tied for fourth place at the Amateur World Series along Canada, Italy, Chinese Taipei and the Dominican Republic. In the 1976 World Amateur Series, Puerto Rico won silver with an 8-2 round robin before leaving the tournament prior to the final round. J. L. de Leon led the tournament with a 0.00 era. After missing the 1978 edition of the World Amateur Series, the team came back in 1980, but finished tied in the seventh place with Venezuela with a 4-7 record. After missing out another version of the Amateur World Series, the team returned in 1984, finishing behind Panama with a record of 6-7, despite gathering a 54-46 advantage in runs. Mariano Quinones 2 .48 was their most effective pitcher. The top hitter was 1B Luis Fontanez 0 .353, 0 .400, 0 .569. Future MLB player Hector Villanueva was part of the roster, but had an unsuccessful tournament going 2 for 13 with a double and no walks. In the 1986 Amateur World Series, Puerto Rico tied for 7th at 5-6, despite outscoring opponents 56-45. Roberto Santana .369 led the series with six stolen bases. Eddie Rodriguez had two saves. By 1988, the Amateur World Series became known as the Baseball World Cup and Puerto Rico beat both No. 3 Taiwan and No. 4 Japan and lost to No. 1 Cuba by just one run. However, losses to Canada, Nicaragua and South Korea kept the team out of the Final Four. CF Ángel Morales 0 .390, 0 .737, 14R, 14 RBI, and DH Helson Rodriguez 0 .300, 0 .462, 0 .650 guided the offensive charge. Victor L. Martinez was 0-1 with a 1.80 era, the lowest on the staff. Migration of MLB All-Stars and Fallout 
Beginning during the last years of the 1980s and extending throughout the 1990s, Puerto Rico saw a major increase in its production of high-caliber players, with a crop that included Ivan Rodriguez, Roberto Alomar, Bernie Williams, Ruben Sierra, Jorge Posada, Juan Gonzalez, Carlos Delgado, Edgar Martinez and Carlos Beltran among several others. This fact severely limited the quantity of talent available for the national baseball team, due to the protective behavior exhibited by the MLB teams that signed these players since their teenage years. In the 1990 Baseball World Cup, Puerto Rico went 7-2 but finished fourth thanks to the format. They were fourth with 52 runs and second in era 2.89, won B. Efrain Garcia 0 .351, 0 .385, 0 .568, 7 RBI, All-Star C. F. Ángel Morales 0 .417, 0 .463, 0 .556, 8 R, 10 RBI and D. H. Helson Rodriguez 0 .371, 0 .385, 0 .714, 3 H. R, 11 RBI paced the offense. Headlining a fine staff was Jesus I. Feliciano 1-0, 0.56. In 1994, Puerto Rico finished with a 3-4 record, with two close one-run losses 3-2 to Panama and 4-3 to the Netherlands. They hit .305 as a team, fifth in that tournament. Top performers were 1B Efrain Garcia 0 .448, 0 .484, 0 .724, 8 RBI in 7 games, C. Jose Lorenzana 0 .400, 0 .455, 0 .500, R. F. Joel Perez 0 .318, 0 .348, 0 .682 and P. Nelson Sanchez 2.25. After being absent from two World Cups, the team returned in 2005 but Puerto Rico Puerto Rico, managed by Bert Peña, went 6-5 despite being outscored overall, 60-56. They finished 8th overall. Randy Ruiz 0 .346, 0 .452, 0 .654, CF Jesus Feliciano 0 .378, 0 .410, 0 .649, 10 R, 9 RBI and Edwards Guzman 0 .343, 0 .375, 0 .543 led the offense however, former MLB player Angel Echevarria had a weak performance with averages of 0 .083, 0 .241, 0 .125. Orlando Roman 2 0, 0 .50 was their clear top starter as four pitchers had eras over eight. Puerto Rico debuted in the inaugural World Baseball Classic by hosting Pool C on March 7, 2006, and defeating Panama with a score of 2-1. The team followed this by winning their second game over the Netherlands, 8-3. Puerto Rico closed the first round by winning Pool C with a 12-2 mercy rule victory over the defending world champion, Cuba. The team opened the second round by defeating the Dominican Republic 7-1. However, the team lost its next game to Venezuela 6-0. Puerto Rico was eliminated with a 4-3 loss in a rematch with Cuba. Topic: 2008 to 2011. Puerto Rico began this Olympic cycle participating in the 2008 America Baseball Cup. The team debuted on September 26, 2008, defeating Mexico 2-1. This game was won by Josue Matos. Puerto Rico concluded the tournament's first round undefeated, with victories over Brazil 6-3, Aruba 7-0, and Guatemala 8-0. In the first two games, Andy Gonzalez scored four doubles and Carlos Rivera hit his second home run of the round. In the game against Aruba, Orlando Roman threw a perfect game over seven innings. In the second round, Puerto Rico defeated Panama 9-4 to qualify for the 2009 Baseball World Cup. On the second date, the team lost their only game of the tournament to Venezuela 5-4. In the next game, the team defeated Netherlands Antilles by 10 runs 14-4. Puerto Rico won the 2008 Americas Baseball Cup on October 5, 2008, defeating Nicaragua in the final. Puerto Rico hosted Pool D of the 2009 World Baseball Classic, debuting with a 7-0 victory over Panama. In its second game, the team defeated the Netherlands 3-1. Both teams met in an immediate rematch to determine the group winner, which Puerto Rico won with scores of 5-0. The team opened the second round by giving the United States its first mercy rule loss, 11-1. Puerto Rico next played Venezuela, losing 2-0. 
Facing the United States in an elimination game, Puerto Rico lost 6–5 after losing the lead during the final inning. Ivan Rodriguez was selected the All-WBC team catcher. For the Baseball World Cup, Puerto Rico, once again led by Eduardo Pérez, created a roster composed of mostly professional players, including several Major League Baseball athletes. The final cut included infielders Alex Centron, Ruben Gotay, Melvin Falou, Carlos Rivera and Angel Sanchez, catchers Orlando Mercado Jr., Steven Morales and Raul Casanova, pitchers Luis Atilano, Mario Santiago, Jose Santiago, Orlando Roman, Juan Padilla, Angel Garcia, Richard Rodriguez, Miguel Mejia, Alexander Woodson, Nelvin Fuentes, Melvin Pizarro and Efrain Nieves as well as outfielders Miguel Negron, Luis Matos y Miguel Abreu. Jose Valentin was selected to perform as both infielder and outfielder. Javier Valentin and Juan Gonzalez were evaluated, but excluded from the final cut due to previous injuries. The fact that most of the roster was professional received some criticism from the amateur circuit. Journalist Dudin Melendez of Periódico La Cordillera wrote in a piece that Perez is not familiar with the amateur players and has not even seen them play. Expressing a similar concern about the Federation's president, Israel Roldan. Juan Carlos Diaz, infielder of the Bravos de Cidra in Baseball AA, openly expressed disappointment when he did not receive an invitation, noting that he deserved it after leading the Liga Caribe division with an average of .632 and the league's final inoffensive. Making its debut on September 10, 2009, Puerto Rico's first opponent is Cuba. For the 2010 Central American and Caribbean Games, the number of players per roster was limited to 20. Consequently, players such as Juan Gonzalez and Jose Valentin were not included in the final cut. Carlos Delgado was included in the preliminary list, but was unable to compete due to injury. The team was mostly composed of professional players such as Victor Raul Gonzalez, Orlando Mercado, Jorge Jimenez, Philip Cuadrado, Adrian Ortiz, Efrain Nieves, Ricard Rodriguez Nick Ortiz, Armando Rios, Christopher Amador, Edwards Guzman and Mario Santiago, but also included three amateurs, Antonio Acevedo, Joyce Feliciano and Manuel Romero. Amateur pitcher Jean Ortega was a last-minute addition due to an injury suffered by Acevedo. Puerto Rico debuted with a victory over Guatemala in seven innings. The following night the team recorded its second victory, 3-2, over Venezuela, in a game that extended to one extra inning. Efrain Nieves debuted with a shutout victory over Panama, allowing only one hit. Puerto Rico was the leader in its group, closing the first round with a 6-0 victory over the United States Virgin Islands. However, the team lost a 0-1 game to Mexico in the semi-finals and the bronze medal to Nicaragua 6-7. For the 2010 Americas Baseball Cup, Eduardo Pérez assembled an entirely different roster. Several players from the minor leagues who were unable to compete at the Central American and Caribbean Games, because this event was not sanctioned by the IBAF, now joined the pre-selection. Only few players, such as Irving Falou were kept from the CAC team. The most notable addition was Gonzalez, who was joined by Fernando Cabrera, Kiko Calero, Federico Baez, Saul Rivera, Ramon Vasquez, Gabriel Martinez, Luis Figueroa, Jorge Padilla, Alex Cora and Christian Colon. Puerto Rico was drafted to Group A, along Argentina, Aruba, Canada, Panama and the Dominican Republic. Topic. Generational shift, 2013 present. After 2011, the IBAF decided to phase out the Baseball World Cup, with the WBC replacing it as the premier competition in international baseball. During this time frame, the team was immersed in a change of the guard, losing MLB All-Stars Ivan Rodriguez, Carlos Delgado and Bernie Williams to retirement. As with the previous editions, Puerto Rico hosted the first round of the 2013 Classic. However, this time the team faced different adversaries following an expansion, defeating Spain 3-0 in its debut. Puerto Rico secured classification to the second round by winning a game over Venezuela, 6-3. The team closed the round by losing the seeding game to the Dominican Republic, 4-2. Puerto Rico opened the second round with a 7-1 loss to the United States. The team remained alive by defeating Italy 4-3. In its second consecutive elimination game, Puerto Rico defeated the United States 4-3. 
Facing the Dominican Republic in another seeding game, the team lost 2-0. Puerto Rico advanced by defeating the defending WBC champion, Japan, with scores of 3-1. In the event finals, the team lost a third contest to the Dominican Republic, 3-0, to finish their participation as the tournament's runner-up. Yadier Molina was the all-WBC catcher, while Ángel Pagán and Nelson Figueroa received positions among the outfielders and pitchers. The date of the 2014 Central American and Caribbean Games has opened the door for Puerto Rico and several other teams to reinforce themselves with MLB players, raising the competitive level of what is usually a low-caliber tournament. The team finished fourth. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Ongoing cycle 2017 to 2021. Puerto Rico repeated her previous WBC performance in 2017, finishing as the tournament's runner-up. For secondary competitions, former MLB player Juan Gonzalez was named as manager making his debut at the 2018 Central American and Caribbean Games. Unable to request athletes contracted to MLB or active in MILB, he assembled a team composed by players active in foreign independent leagues, the local Doble A Amateur League and veteran free agents with previous professional experience, making the final cut following a preparatory tournament. Gonzalez made his official debut as manager in a 5-3 victory over Venezuela. In its next outing, Puerto Rico defeated Cuba 8-1 to snap a 36-year winning streak at the CACG. This was followed by wins over the Dominican Republic and Mexico On July 26, 2018, Puerto Rico defeated second-place Colombia 2-1 to clinch the first place of the round robin. This was followed by inconsequential losses to Panama and Guatemala Gonzalez closed his first participation as manager by leading Puerto Rico to the Central American and Caribbean gold medal. Topic: <inaudible> Puerto Rico women's national baseball team. In November 2009, the Puerto Rico women's national baseball team made its international debut, participating in the first edition of the Women's Pan American Baseball Cup, which was classificatory to the 2010 Women's Baseball World Cup. In its first game, the team defeated Venezuela with scores of 6-3. Puerto Rico scored five runs in the first inning and one in the seventh, while Venezuela scored one in the first, second and fourth innings. The game was won by Joanna Ramos. In its second game, the team defeated Cuba 7-5. Cuba scored first with two runs in the first and one in the third, but Puerto Rico got on the scoreboard by scoring twice in the third and added two more runs in the fifth. In the seventh inning Puerto Rico scored three times and Cuba two. The game was won by Crisia Rivera, who by then was 15 years old, while Elizabeth Santana registered a saved game. For the team, Lissandra batted 3-2 with an RBI, Coralize Ortiz 4-2 and Yariam Rivera with an RBI. In the third date, the team participated in a double header. In the first game Puerto Rico defeated the Dominican Republic by mercy rule, 10-0. With this victory the team advanced to the finals, classifying to the World Cup. In the second game of the date, they defeated Cuba in a rematch 3-1. After four games, Puerto Rico dominated the statistics in batting average .347, earned run average and defensive percent .950. In individual fields, first baseman Berrios, who was 20 years old, led in hits 6, RBIs 5, runs 7, and stolen bases 3, and was second in batting average .500. In their fifth game, Puerto Rico defeated the Dominican Republic by mercy rule in the third inning, 20-0. The game was won by Ariana Vélez. The team concluded their first participation by winning the silver medal, only losing to Venezuela in the finals. In 2010, the team won the V-Cuban Sports Olympics, defeating the Occidentales de Cuba seven runs to one in the final. Yinoska Claudio was selected the tournament's most valuable player, also finishing second in batting average .571. The team compiled a record of 4-1, only losing to Centrales de Cuba. Tournament record World Baseball Classic Olympic Games 
Baseball World Cup Gold, 1 Silver, 4 1947 Bronze, 4 1952 Intercontinental Cup Silver, 1 Bronze, 1 1989 America's Baseball Cup Gold, 1 2008 Pan American Games Silver, 2 1959 Bronze, 4 1967 1979 1987 1995 Central American and Caribbean Games Gold, 3 1959 2002 2018 Silver, 3 1962 1966 1990 Bronze, 3 1974 1978 1993 World University Baseball Championship 2006 6th place Harlem Baseball Week 1992 5th place 2012 Caribbean Series 14 times champions 1951 1953 to 55 1972 1974 75 1978 1983 1987 1992 93 1995 2000 2017 2018 topic see also baseball in puerto rico World Baseball Classic Olympic Baseball World Cup America's Baseball Cup Pan American Games Intercontinental Cup Central American and Caribbean Games IBAF World Rankings List of players from Puerto Rico in MLB Baseball Awards 2013 World Baseball Classic Rosters 2009 World Baseball Classic Rosters 2006 World Baseball Classic Rosters <laughs>